know, I look at the guys like KG, and the guys like Kobe's been there 13, 14 years, and um, you know, now you understand that, you know, them guys is, you know, as you as you get older and you look at the young guys coming to the league, you know, you want this. You, know, you want to be a, a part of the locker room discussion. You want to be a part of the young excitement. Chris, what was your favorite it, dunk during the game? Mine. Yeah. Yours? Yeah. Your own? <laughs> yeah, because yeah. if I don't claim it, nobody else will. All right, how'd you enjoy Kanye and him at halftime, man? Did you guys get a CD of that or were you game planning the whole Yeah, no, nah, we weren't game planning. We came and watched the show. It was, uh, it was a great performance. Um, Rihanna did a good job. Drake did a good job. And, I mean, that's what they do, man. That's, that's, what, that's what they are known for. So it's like, uh, you know, a lot of emotions, a lot of, a lot of butterflies in the stomach, very, very anxious, very, you know, in some ways kind of, kind of even nervous. And I haven't been nervous for a game in a long, long time. But, you know, it's kind of what I expected. I've been in a, a bunch of all-star games uh, in my career. And, uh, you know, it just so happens that, you know, big men don't get too much love in all-star games. So, you know, when you touch it, you almost have to shoot it. Hey Chris, talk about Kobe's performance here at the house, man. Man, it's outstanding. Outstanding. You know, I talked to him right before the game, told him, you know, let's go. And he's one of those guys that's a lot like me, you know, ultimate competitor. You know, it's an all-star game. It's supposed to be all fun and games, but at the end of the day, we want to win. And Rondo, when you guys all came into the game, LA fans gave you a hard time. You expected that? Yeah, it was, it was no big deal. No big deal. <laughs> well, yeah, you know, I told him I didn't really want to play too much. Uh, you know, just kind of rest my foot, my hand and stuff. So, you know, it was good just to get out there and uh, get up and down the court. Hey, Paul, did you expect the Laker fans to boo you a little bit, or you think you get a pass because it was all-star? Yeah, I really don't know what to expect. You know, <laughs> I expected to have fun today. Um, it's great for, for, for the league to get behind Blake and what he's doing. You know, it's important for me to step aside. I, I've had that. You know what I mean? It's about me coming out and performing and staying healthy. You know, you're doing the right things after 15 years, but, you know, it's about them at this point. It's great. I love it. I love Blake, man. You know, I, this summer, uh, I got a chance to get to know him a little bit because, you know, we were doing therapy at the same place. So we're sitting next to each other most of the time. We got a chance to kind of talk. And, and with nobody around, I got a chance to know him before you know, all of this happened. And um, I'm just very happy for him. Yeah. Well, I, yeah, we're looking forward to it. You know, we're up for the challenge. Pat and I have been talking you know, this whole time uh, about looking forward to it and you know, getting back at it. And, you know, we've been in communication with the best of the fellas. And, uh, you know, we all can't wait to get started. You forgot the last game? What last game? 